One of the most opportunistic grasses that most people are familiar with is cheatgrass. This invasive grass comes from Europe and arrived in about the late 1890s. This grass germinates in the fall and the spring, giving it the advantage over native perennials. Some say this is the weed that won the West, as it has invaded tens of millions of acres. Cheatgrass completes its life cycle very quickly and produces upwards of 500 seeds, which can be viable for about six years. In the spring, when the plant is green, animals eat it, but when it dries out, it becomes hazardous to them. This plant can be very difficult to treat once it becomes established. Hand pulling works in small patches and pulls easy because of the shallow root system. Herbicide works when the plants are actively growing, but before other grasses come out of dormancy. Strategic mowing, burning, and grazing can also help. There is testing taking place on a bacteria that is showing some positive results on cheatgrass. The most important thing about noxious weeds is to educate yourself, protect the landscape for wildlife and future generations. If you think you have noxious weeds, contact your local weed district, extension office, or Department of Agriculture.